They are the superstars of the show, but these performers get paid in hay, oats and the occasional treat. Not bad work if you're a horse, that is. Cavalia, which opens in Singapore on 12 August, is the world's largest touring show and it features 50 horses and 42 human performers. The show features 11 different horse breeds from all over the world and being the star performers, all 50 horses arrived here in style flying from Belgium to Singapore on a spacious chartered jet. The horses also have their own roomy stables and get pampered every day with showers, grooming and even massages. And from the looks of it, the horses are just settling nicely in Singapore. It is a live show and there are things that are just like us, there are days where they're a little bit more attentive than others, but I would say 99.9% .9 of the time he does absolutely anything I want to do. He's a pleasure to work with. With Orion, one of the things you can expect with him, they're one of the highest jumping teams we have in Roman riding. So what we do is what's called the bigger jump in Roman riding. They set the bar, it goes about chest height on a human. So uh, me and both of the Roman team will uh, go across the jump while standing on them. Well, every horse is different. The acts are different. Um, different horses adjust differently to different elements. So I would just say generally, since I've been here, I've never seen a horse take longer than a year. I've never seen it take less than about two months. All of the tents, though, are climate controlled. We do have air conditioning. So while they're working here in the stables, in the warm-up and on stage, of course, you know, they're not working in the heat. They, they're working in air conditioning. Certain horses do work better for certain aspects of the show. Spanish purebreeds, Lusitanos, and Illusions typically work really well for dressage. The quarter horses, the paints, the stockier built horses that are for short distances, fast bursts of speed, work really well for the trick riding and Roman riding. Um, we have a warm blood that does the jumping. We have big draft horses, a Percheron and a Contois, which do the bareback number, which um, acrobats stand on them and you know do a backflip. They do different things on them. So carrying their weight is nothing because they weigh you know over 2,000 pounds so um, Troubadour which was the miniature horse that we saw earlier he just does one little funny part of the show and nobody rides him and so you know yes different horses are suited better for different aspects of the show. Uh, he's in the carousel part which is um, the carousel is a military tradition of dressage so that's where you perform an act with eight riders or more or less and eight horses where they do um, synchronized movements. He's lazy sometimes, but he always does it because we try to establish that relationship where horses do stuff for us that they don't do it because they're forced to, just because they want to do it for us, so it's, it's fine. If you know him and you know how he works, then you can get him to do whatever you want. 